What's going on guys, TBF Gaming, welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're jumping once again into 7 Days to Die, but it's Alpha 19 time. Really excited for Alpha 19, we've been waiting for this for a very long time. It is time to jump into a default game. We're going to go with a random gen, and we're going to go with a World Seed of Drifter, all caps, D-R-I-F-T-E-R. We're going to go, like I said, default across the board, so 60 minute days, sprint across the board, XP multiplier just 100% and everything else like i said just straight straight default no no uh was it every three days airdrops we drop everything on death the whole nine completely default we're gonna jump into this gameplay here really excited for alpha 19 there's been a bunch of changes mainly cosmetic is the one that you're gonna notice right away but as we jump further into the game you're gonna see a whole bunch of other changes first off check it out we got loading screens there's a few different loading screens and you can see it right there the zombies are in hd which is really cool there's a whole bunch of tool tips that you can click through here if you left and right click you can kind of go back and forth through the different tips all kinds of cool stuff about sneaking armor some of the different things within the game I will take the time to kind of read some of them because there's probably a bunch of stuff about the game that I don't know. So what we try to do here is try to keep these into 20 to 25 minute episodes. And yeah, let's let's go through this. This is a one life challenge. So if I die, it is over, especially for this first ones. Now, if you, you guys know we're playing on experimental, this is the experimental branch. It just came out, which means there's bound to be problems. There's a good chance that we're going to get restarted. And yeah, you just never know. You never know there's going to be problems. Oh, but like that. Look at that. We got a load problem. Let's see what's up here. Okay, now we're in. It took just a second. We had to jump back out. We still had some mods loaded, and we couldn't seem to exit out because the mods loaded. But check it out. The UI has changed. A whole bunch of change here. We did get the little starting message. We've got our same starter stuff that we always have. Let's leave that there, that there. This is that same one that you always get. Just a friendly reminder on that you're... Wait, whoa, whoa, words. Try it again. Start over. Just a friendly reminder that you pay on time, every time, or there's consequences. Next time you won't be so nice. Thanks for the gear, but you still owe us. See you soon, the Duke. So there you go. We're going to go ahead and scrap that guy. All right, let's get through the starter quest stuff. Really excited to get into this. Alpha 19 just brings a lot of changes. If nothing else, you can see it is beautiful. Look at that. They have definitely updated it. It looks way better. There's quite a few mechanics that have changed. There's some different status effects that you're going to have to experience in this one. It's going to be really cool. Let's go ahead and get our bread roll going. Uh, yeah, really excited for this. Now, we've been thinking of a series name for it. I'm not real good with stuff like that, but we, we're going to go with Drifter. Uh, it is a one-life challenge, so we'll have to see how long we last. We're not real good at this game, so it might be a short one. might be a short playthrough, but it's okay because a lot of times the experimental branch does have require a bunch of restarts, so we'll kind of have to see what's up. All right, let's go ahead and pick up the bedroll again, and we could probably just leave it down, but we're going to roll with it. All right, gather wood. Let's go get some wood. Let's go see if there is... Any small trees to knock over? Probably not, knowing my luck. All right, let's just go with it. We also need small stones, so keep an eye out for small stones on the ground. Kind of have to see how the game is running. Really excited. Really excited to get into this, guys. But yeah, big, big fan of Seven Days to Die. It's been a long thing, or a long standing thing here on the channel. We've been playing this one for a very long time. So we're really excited to continue playing this now in Alpha 19. I think we started way back on. Alpha 13 or 14, maybe Alpha 12? I, you know, I don't even remember. We played so many different ones. And then we started the YouTube channel somewhere around Alpha 13 or 14, I believe. I think. Oh, man, here we go. Our first HD zombie. There we go. We got the stones. Look at this guy. Let's look at this guy. Oh, he looks totally different. Okay. Oh, no. Well, we already got hit by a zombie. That happened. Got him. There you go. First kill. Barehanded. That's what I'm talking about. It's much better than most of our starts. There we go. Let's go ahead and check out some of the stuff that we got going here. I mean, I keep hitting the wrong button. We're playing another game that has similar control style. So we're struggling with the buttons now. Is this what we're looking for? There we go. That's what we needed. All right, let's go ahead and make our first axe. Craft it up. Look at this, man. Right next to a town starting off. I like it. This is really good. This is definitely much better. Starting off in a, in a green area for a change. That's a really good thing. All right, let's get a few more of that. We need to make up our fiber clothes. So we're going to go like so. We're going to do all the fiber stuff. I know we only have to do the two to get us going here. But we're going to do that one, that one, gloves, hat, hood. Okay, and hold on. Fiber. Oh, come on. It does reset it every time. That's weird. And fiber shoes. There we go. Gloves, that one, that one. Get that hat going. And last one. There you go. Look at that. We're all dressed up. I like it. Perfect. 
All right, now we have elemental protection. Nice. Now, I'm kind of surprised that the zombies spawn in right away. You used to get like a little bit of a buffer before they would start spawning in. All right, next one, gather wood. Let's go ahead and use our hatchet. Oh, the hatchet looks way different. Look at that. Okay. That looks much, much different. All right, go ahead and get this up. Looks very, uh, very rudimentary compared to the old school one. All right, let's go with the club. Bam. Yeah, but there is some new status effects in this, so it's pretty cool. So if you get hit, you have a chance to have like a sprained arm or, a, you know, just uh, abrasions. All kinds of different things like that. It's pretty cool. I think it's a really good addition. Let's go ahead and get a bunch of wood before we get moving here. Let's go ahead and put that one there. Get this club down here. There we go. Oh, my bad, my bad. We don't need to do that. We'll get just a little bit more wood. And then we need to find some bird's nest for some feathers. All right, let's search for some bird's nest. Okay, just kind of look around real quick. Some more stone action. Man, every single building in here is going to be updated. So it's almost like we're playing this for the first time just because everything looks so different. So you're probably going to hear me say at least 1,001 times, oh, wow, that looks amazing. So just to get that out of the way, it's going to happen. <laughs> All right, let's get a little bit more stone. And then we still need... A feather. There we go. Okay, this guy. There's six feathers there. And six more there. So let's go with a bow. And we need some arrows. There you go. Bam. We got all the stuff. Got that. Alright, and then we need to get a frame going. Okay. Wait for those arrows to make up. We'll kind of search just a little bit more before we head into town here. And we'll do just a little bit of looting, trying to find ourselves somewhere to hang out. Now, the plan for this, we're calling the series Drifter because we are going to try to move around quite a bit so we can get a really good look at all the different POIs and just kind of see how the generation works. The random gen is supposed to really be reworked to where it's going to give you a little bit more balanced town. So now there's over 500 POIs that they're going to add into the game, or that are added into the game, and it's supposed to cycle through those 500 before you see any kind of repeat. So it should really change the way that that works, which I think is just a huge, huge addition. All right, let's go with that. Let's go ahead and upgrade it. There we go. All right. Let's go ahead and make a couple more frames just to make sure we have a couple. And what's next? Small stones. Need some more stones. All right. Get this guy here. There we go. And we'll f go fight this zombie guy over here. Okay. Go like so. All right. Let's get a campfire crafted up. And let's go ahead and take this guy out with the club. Here we go. First club fight. All right. Ready. Power shot. Okay, just some regular shots. Oh, man. Oh, that was awesome. Take that, man. The exploding head. All right. Check out the buildings over here. Kind of check that out. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Is this the one that has the underground? I don't know if it is or not. It's locked. It's not like we can't jump over, but it's locked. Let's keep taking out some zombies, get some of that good, good XP going. We need to go ahead and place the campfire here in just a second. All right, let's do it. It's kind of nice playing on default difficulty for the first time in a long time. There we go. Get those headshots in. Yes! Man, we're getting lucky with the headshots. I like it. Okay, no search in there. Clunky Oil Company. That'd be a nice spot. But yeah, we're planning on moving around a lot. Now, we still might choose a horde base, and then that will be our horde base, but we'll just move around a lot. That's kind of the idea here. Kind of see what it looks like. See how the draw distance looks. The map definitely looks beautiful. The POIs are building in a little weird. Oh, you know what? I didn't check. Do we need to update our settings since we moved to the new version here let's see oh here we go oh my goodness ultra apply oh man i'm sorry guys we were looking we were sitting here gushing about the graphics and we had it set to low so anyone clowning on me i'm sorry <laughs> there you go look at much better look at that i was wondering why things were loading in so poorly let's go check this place out Ooh, look at that one this one's cool. Dump and lung coal mining. 
That might be kind of an intense POI, but I feel like we could still do it. Should we go for it? It's probably a little above our pay grade, but I think we can try it out. Let's do it. All right, let's take out some zombies here. There we go. Take that. Yeah! Busting heads. All right. Um, you know, we don't have a gun yet. It's probably not a good idea to go in there just yet. Let's see. Locked. All right, let's go look, and we will just be ready to run out if we have to. Okay. I feel like there's definitely going to be a trap in here. What do you guys think? Yep, there it is. Okay, what do we got? Get your bearings. There you go. Oh, what's up? You look much improved. Look at that. You're a very pretty new zombie. There we go. Search some of that garbage up. It is dark in here. All right. Search this guy. Now we might just for the just for the video, I think we're gonna adjust the the gamma up just a little bit. So let's go like that. And this is only because we're recording, and I just don't want you guys to have to see super dark awfulness. Okay, so do we go down here? I definitely want to go down, but is there no way back up? Oh man, this is definitely a brand new POI I've never seen. Okay. Oh, here we go. New back. Even the backpack looks different. All right, there's that guy. There's another moldy backpack. All right. I guess we go down, guys. Seems like a really, really bad idea. Oh, there's a box up there, though. You see that? Secret stuff hiding out. Okay, this could be the end. Let's go. A little bit of parkour. Okay. Uh, the one thing I am worried about is, well, everything. But if this is a mine, is there going to be like a bear down here? Be the shortest series ever. Okay. Man, all right. Okay, we go. We go in. Let's go. Do some sneaking. Okay, there's a couple of them. All right, the big guy's coming. Got him. Got him. Okay. There's a Cowboy Bob over here. Oh, good. Cowboy Bob is a runner. Okay, get up, get up. Got him. Or maybe he wasn't a runner. Maybe he was faking. Okay. This seems like a really bad deal. I had to come in day one. It's a really bad choice. All right, get that. Get all those arrows back. All right, let's go. Okay. Just be ready to run if we have to. Generator bank. Nothing. This does not feel smart. Okay. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. I see you. Oh, my God. Come on. There we go. Now, do we have a skill point yet? No skill point yet. Let's go ahead and finish up this quest. Does this give us a skill point if I do this? There you go. Did we get that skill point or no? There we go. All right, there we go, skill point. We are gonna go with a little bit of strength. We're gonna get that strength going. Skull crusher, bam. Strength, bam. And then we really need, oh, there's a couple things we usually go with. What is it, the, the sex rex? Or, let's see, there's a few of them here. Hidden strike, run and gun. Archery is probably a good idea because we're using so much archery right now. Here we go. Let's go with iron guts so we have to eat a little bit less. And maybe this one. There you go. 
All right. Like I said, there's a couple of things that I would have rather spent our money on, but or our skill points on. But I'm okay with what we used. Oh man, look at that. This is what I'm saying. They're trying to sneak us today. Alright. There's two of them over here. Let's go with this one first. Alright. One down. There you go. Come on. Got her. Okay. Alright. So far so good. You can see the trader is not far off. We could, If we can hurry and finish this POI, we can run at the trader real quick. Probably should have done that before we came in here, right? Okay, we're still sneaking. Okay. There's another guy there. Got him. That sneak shot. It's a bag. Kind of nervous to jump down. Let's stay up here just for a minute longer. Okay. I think we're going to have to hop down. There's a ladder right there. Nothing. Okay, definitely going to be something up here. We are out of arrows. Dang it. All right. There's a big guy. Please don't be as bad as I'm worried it is. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> she scared the crap out of us. All right. Come on. Okay, he's not running. Everything's fine. Here we go. Hit him in the head. Let's go. Got him. Got him. Oh, man. He was worth extra XP. Was he a big guy? Okay. Nothing in the dumpster. Okay. This just feels like a trap. Search that. That. Oh, here we go. Oh, that was the good loot. All right. Okay. Do I need to search these? Yep. Ammo pile. All right. Check it out. We got a couple things out of that. Um, a scope. Wow. A stone spear. Well, you definitely use that guy. Okay. We can scrap the land came block. Oh, no, we can't. All right. What else can we get rid of here? We can wear that. Scrap that, scrap that, scrap that. Resort. All right. Let's break open these guys real quick. Shotgun Messiah. A little worried. There we go. Break into this guy. There we go. Gun store. All right. Padded chest armor and a wooden club. This is a little bit better than the club we have. Padded chest armor. I think we're going to go with that one. And what else can we do here? Leg armor. Scrap that guy. Okay. Some shamway. We're already just full on inventory. Alright, get this guy. Some water and some other stuff there. I'm sure we're missing something. I'm sure of that, but we're going to try to get out of here all right here we go here we go okay okay awesome we're stuck dang okay oh here we go okay can I put down a frame Yep, I hear you guys. <laughs> we got a couple of wanderers. It's all good. Okay. Like that. And like that. We're out. Is it just regular guys out here? Yep. 
We're going to go to the trader. Where's the trader? That way. We're out. All right, 370 meters this way. But yeah, man, I'm excited about this. This is not too bad of a start. we got some good loot to get started here. 300 meters to the trader. So let's make our way that way. There we go. Another one down. Um, Gunpowder. Don't really have a use for it just yet, but that's fine. All right, we got the cafe. I really like that the trader looks like it's in town. This is kind of awesome. All right, let's keep making our way this way. We will search the car real quick. No, maybe not. Okay, I lied. 120 meters. Man, look at this, an in-town trader. I like it. It's a different one too, I haven't seen. Oh, you know what, this is the one that I've seen like in the north of Navisgan, I think. So that means it might have some good secret loot for us. And it's only 1,400, got plenty of time. Let's go talk to the trader. Here we go, guys. Oh, look at that. Some more updated POIs. Cool. I feel like we're going to have to choose a home right next to this place. Look at this place. Absolutely beautiful. Let's go see how that trader's looking. All right. What's up, man? Hugh, what's up, Hugh? Not real familiar with you, Hugh. All right. Let's talk to you. Can I see your inventory? Let's see. What would you like to buy from me? I don't have much, but I'll sell you what I got. Uh, do you want a land claim block? You don't. Uh, do you want any of these rounds that I can't use just yet? There we go. I feel like 762 we're probably going to not need just yet. And I don't really want to give you the rest. <laughs> I'm, I'm kind of stingy, man. Nothing. All right, I think that's it for right now. Let me see. Is there anything? Scope mod, scope times eight mod. That's freaking amazing. How Are they worth a lot of money? Probably, but not yet. All right, so I have a, a whole $86. <gasps> if I had 2000 I could buy a forge. Steel pickaxe. I need lots of money for that. Iron spear, 1300 And under your secret stash, a gyrocopter. I just need one, two, three, $100,000, which it's day one. I should have that by now. Well, Dang. it's about time you bought something. Yeah, man, you're awesome. All right, can I can I reach the safe? Can I try to unlock it? Oh, we can if we have lock picks, huh? Okay. All right, let's check out this place real quick. Usually this has some good secret loot in it. This is the one that used to at least. There we go in there. Yep, we'll come back to that. Should be like in these little side things. Oh, man, you got bird's nest in here too. Nice. All right. You sh there shouldn't be any zombies in here, right? Okay. Nothing up here. Really cool looking, though. We need to go down. All right. Try going back down. And we'll try this way. There we go. Go over here real quick. Aha, there we go. Get in that munitions box. There you go. Give us some good loot, man. Give me some good loot. The munitions box always takes so long to search, but it's usually really worth it. Uh, some more rounds and some iron arrows. We'll take it. All right. I don't know why we're closing doors behind us. We're just well trained, I guess. Okay. Nothing up here. Nope. All right, nothing down there either. Okay, double check. Okay, I'll jump up here and check here. No. Okay, destroyed workbench, it's too bad. All right, you are outside, right? I hear you. Yeah, okay, they're outside. Just making sure, I didn't want to get surprised. Aha, munitions box number two. All right, we need some better loot than the last one. Hook me up, guys. And then we have just enough time we can go try to find ourselves a nice little spot to hang out. A blunderbuss, some ammo, and a little bit of shotgun rounds. Okay. All right, I guess we'll check out your upstairs. Okay, duffel bag I can take out of. Desk. 
Oh, it says he's talking down there. Yep, just up here going through your stuff, man. Nothing to see here. We're just making sure you're secure, man. We're trying to keep you safe. Cardboard box. There's a lot of good stuff in your, in, up here, man. Not to, just don't let him know. All right, let's go this way. A couple random small things to search up. Nothing. There we go. Very nice. Very, very nice. All right, cool. That is some good searching. All right. Let's go back in and sell the rest of the stuff to him one more time. Oh, wait. There we go. Lead pipe. Very nice. A nickel All right, man. Worth a dime anymore. Okay, whatever you say, man. All right, let's go ahead and see what you'll buy for me now. All this new stuff I got. Stone shovel? No. Iron arrows I'm keeping. Blunderbuss. I uh, mean, I really don't like the blunderbuss. And, yep, yeah, we're going to get rid of it. Get rid of that. Flashlight. And then I guess we could wear those. Which one? Denim pants? Get rid of the shorts. Get rid of the candlestick. There we go. Get rid of the oil for right now. Iron arrow heads I want to keep. And sell some of those. I guess you're not all so right. bad after all. Oh man, that's so nice of you. It's pretty nice of you, man. Alright. Now, there is one more thing we can do. We can go down here, but I, I want to make sure we have enough time to go ahead and take over a spot that we're going to hide out in. Oh, come on. Close the door. What's up? The businessman. How you, you look good in HD, man. Not real good, but good. Dang, arms. All right, shade tree auto. Am I gone funeral home? A random house. I, just, I want to stay right here next to this. We could do the little funeral home, but there's not much for hiding over here. I mean, not the funeral home, but the uh, Shade Tree Auto. All right, I think Shade Tree Auto is the way to go. But, man, this is, this is looking good over here. Let's get a good screenshot of this before we forget. Bam. Screenshot action. Bam. There we go. All right. Let's do the Shade Tree Auto. I feel like we could get up on the roof in here and hide out. Okay. Search the barrel. What do we got? Is it bad? It sounds bad. There it is. There we go. There you go. One down. All right. Let's do this. Got that nice, intense day one feeling going on. Anybody? Hello? There you go. Wake up, buddy. Switch to the good arrows. Oh, we can shoot through it. Okay. Okay, I just don't want to get snuck up on. I feel like we're going to get snuck up on here. There we go. There we go. Okay, wait for him. That should have been a good shot. There we go. Got him. Give my arrows back. Can't quite get my arrows. Okay, we'll have to go in there. Unlocked. Thank you. Give me all those arrows back. Okay, what do we got? Close that. Open that. All right, we are kind of overweight. We got to be just a little bit careful. We're going to be kind of slow. Okay, let's close that. Where you at? Oh, it's a big guy too. Dang it. I hate those guys. Okay, come on out. Okay, ready? Yep. <laughs> oh, no, he got through. My bad. <laughs> it didn't work as good as I thought. Got, got him. Give me the arrows back. Nice. Okay. Oh, man. Shake the hands out. Pretend we're not scared just for a second. Okay. Anything in here? Was that the only guy from up top, hopefully? All right. Now, what I want to do, though, is close that. 
Break down this. 1700. Let's hurry and get up top. Bam. Get up here. Oh, oh there's another guy. Are you going down? Okay. Oh, no, no, no. Get, get him. Got him. There we go. And now we broke out that ladder, so they shouldn't be able to get us, right? So we're kind of safe right here. And I think this is where we're going to chill out for the night time. So I think we're going to end it here. This would be a good, good spot to kind of hang out. We'll knock out this real quick, see if we get some good loot inside of here. And then that'll do it for episode number one. So be right around that 30-minute mark. And then tomorrow morning we'll get started on a brand new day. We'll head back to the trader, do a couple things over there. There we go. Lock picks, repair kit, stone axe. Nice. Anything out there? I don't know. We're going to stay in here. We don't even care. All right, guys. There you go. Hopefully you enjoy it. Like, comment, subscribe, all those kind of things. I appreciate all the support. Can't wait to get further into Alpha 19. Going to be a lot of fun. We'll try to record this every day for the next two or three days. Hopefully there's not going to be any updates that make us start over on the playthrough. I'll do a little bit of storage up here just to get us going for the next day or two. Well, well that's not good. I guess we're going down. All right, guys, I'll see you in the next episode.